Okay. Hello everyone. Uh, my name is Nikhil Gajam, working as assistant professor in Department of Computer Science and Engineering in Valchan Institute of Technology, Solapur. In this session, we will see inserting a node at the end of singly circular linked list. Learning outcome. At the end of this session, students will be able to write a C program for inserting a node at the end of singly circular linked list. Now, we have already know what is singly circular linked list uh, and a linked list. In linked list, uh, uh, actually the, it is a collection of nodes where each node contains two parts, uh, data and the pointer part. Uh, in singly circular linked list, uh, last node's next part will have an address of first node. So this is the difference between singly linked list and singly circular linked list. So this is a diagrammatical representation. The above diagram represents a singly linked list and this below diagram represents singly circular linked list. Now we will see an algorithm for inserting a new node at the end of singly circular linked list. Now step one, uh, create the new node and store the values. So whenever you want to insert a new node inside any linked list, in that case, first task is to allocate the memory for a new node and store a value entered by the user in the data part of that new node. Step two, if linked list is empty, set start value to the new node and new node's next part will address to the or will point to the same node. If linked list is empty means the, the uh, linked list is not present or there are no nodes present previously. So whatever a new node you are inserting at the end that will become a singly circular linked list. So in that case set the start value uh, to the new node only and new node's next pointer will hold the address of the same node. Step 3, if linked list is not empty, means some nodes are uh, already present inside a singly circular linked list. In that case, traverse from first to last and set our new node's next part to the start and set last node's next part to the new node. So whenever you want to insert uh, a new node at the end, so you cannot traverse, so you cannot point directly to the last node because there is only one global pointer we call it as start. Okay, you have to traverse from first node to last node using some temporary variable. Okay, there are no previous pointers present in singly circular linked list. So you cannot traverse directly from a start to the last node using previous pointer. So in doubly linked list, it is possible, but in singly linked list or singly circular linked list, it is not possible to traverse or to go directly from first node to last node. So you have to use uh, a temporary pointer to traverse from first node to last node. Once temp is pointing to the last node, then you can connect the temp with the new node and new node with the start. So this is an algorithm. Suppose I want to insert 10, 20, 30. So I, how uh, the values will be inserted inside a singly circular linked list. Initially start value have null. Suppose I have inserted 10 and next 20 and next 30. So after inserting 10, 20, 30, a singly circular linked list will look like this where start is pointing to first node 10, 30 is my last node, last node's next pointer will point to the first node. Now suppose I want to insert a 50 at the end. So this is a, pre a previous how linked list, singly circular linked list looks like. So this is my uh, singly circular linked list and I want to insert a new node 50. So your first task is to allocate memory for this new node. So I have allocated memory for new node and store 50 value in the data uh, part of this new node. Next task, traverse from first node to last node. So temp, I have used a temporary variable temp which will traverse from first node to last node. Once temp is pointing to last node, store temp arrow next to the new node. Next, new nodes next will store the address of start. This is how you are inserting a new node inside a singly circular linked list. Now a value of start will not change. A start will hold the address of first node. You are not inserting at the beginning. You are inserting at the end. So value of start will not change in this case. Now you can pause and you can answer for this question. In singly circular linked list, can we traverse to the last node from the first node in big of one time complexity? You can pause and you can answer. So answer is no. In 
doubly linked list with the previous pointer in doubly circular linked list it is possible uh, to traverse from last node uh, to the last node from the first node in big of one time complexity but in singly circular linked list it is not possible uh, to traverse from first node to last node begin uh, with a one step it is not possible you have to traverse uh, from first node to last node uh, one by one okay okay we will see a program now okay i will write a code for insert at end okay so this uh, suppose uh, this is your structure node which contains two parts first one is data value and second one is a pointer which will point to the next node this is a star a start variable global variable which will always point uh, point to the first node this is a function called as insert at end which we are going to implement or i will write the code for this uh, this is display function which will display uh, all the nodes which are present in singly circular linked list this is a main so first task is or first case is insert at end second will be display third for exit so case 1 i will call the function insert at end okay so case 2 for display case 3 for exit so this is a skeleton i have used i will implement only insert at end function okay so first step is to declare two variables new node and temp so i will declare those this is struct node star new node comma uh, star temp these are two pointer variables so new node is for uh, which will point to the new node which which is insert which uh, you will insert at the end of singly circular linked list temp is a variable which is used for traversing from first node to last node okay so next task is now to allocate memory for new node so new node equal to this is structure node star this is type casting malloc this is size of this is structure node so you have allocated memory dynamically for new node next task printf enter value to insert at end okay next one is scanf this is percent d comma address of new node data so you have stored the value at new node's data part so while inserting first you have to check whether singly circular linked list is empty or not how to check that if start double equal to null if start value have null means uh, sing, uh, still singly circular linked list is not created okay so if singly circular linked list is not present set the value start equal to new node sorry so start will point to new node and new node next next part will point to itself so this is new node so this is a a code for uh, inserting a new node if singly circular linked list is empty okay else part else means uh, some nodes are already available in singly circular linked list in that case uh, you have to traverse from first node to last node first and then insert the new node at the last okay so i will use temp initially it will have a value of start so temp will point to start or first node so i will traverse while this temp arrow next is not equal to start temp equal to temp arrow next so one by one a step a temp will move forward and it will reach to the last node so once temp is pointing to the last node next one is joining uh, or inserting a new node between temp and a start so how to insert that temp arrow next equal to new node and next new node arrow next equal to start okay so using this two step you can insert a new node Uh, at the last so what i have done temp arrow next last node's next part will store the address of new node and new node's next part will store the address of start so automatically a new node will be inserted at the end i will execute this code
okay first one insert at end suppose i want to insert 10 again insert at end i want to insert suppose 20 and i will call function display so initially 10 will be inserted initially singly linked list uh, singly circular linked list was empty only one node will be present uh, 10 will be inserted and next 20 will be inserted at last so this is a code for uh, insert at end okay so this code will insert the new node at the end of singly circular linked list okay i will we will uh, switch back to the presentation okay these are some references i have used for creation of this video thank you